Hello YouTube. This is an unboxing video for some Funko Pops I ordered because I like watching them. I'm sure other people like watching them, so um, I ordered some. I'm gonna go ahead and get into them. Here we go. This is uh, from Epic Collectibles. This box was uh, A270. Um, that's shipping included. Which one? Okay, which one of these was one that I don't know what's in them. And the other one is, I think it's this one. Okay, I don't know which one is which. I ordered uh, three Funkos from, was it Epic Collectibles? I don't know here in a second. Um, but the other one came from Marvel. Um, no, no, it came from Walmart, and it looks like a like a Marvel DC box. I'm not good at making videos, people. This is my first one. And I don't know how to open this without revealing this in it. Okay, okay, I can see stuff in there. But this might be the one that I know what it is. So, if it's in, it's not. Okay, these are um, not my thingy. Okay, okay, this, I know what this one is. Alright, this one's a Ninja Turtle, Super Shredder Special Edition. Uh, because I'm a Ninja Turtle fan, I thought these were really cool on, uh, Epic Collectibles. There's that one. And it's not really a mystery on these. This is, a uh, Tanjiro from Demon Slayer, Demon, uh, and, um, this one's pretty cool, it looked neat, so I figured I'd pick it up. Dirty, but my deal is I want to collect them only in mint. Like I'm not a big fan of used stuff. I don't want people playing with my toys. <laughs> so that's that's going to be really the only thing I'm interested in. A lot of these I don't know what I'm going to do with. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna collect them or or try and get rid of some of them or what. I'm always looking for deals and. But some of these are really cool and I'm I'm not going to be able to let them go no matter what if someone offered me because they're just this is neat these are all nostalgic stuff from when i grew up i grew up in that um hey i'm 1986 but um all these things are just so cool that i don't know okay these are the ones i have no idea what they are all right and there's supposed to be six of these i think it was a batman batman was a little um icon that they had on it but it may not be because it didn't even mention anything about Batman or anything. So I'm I'm really not sure. I went through more um, Walmart for it. I think, okay, there's another box in here, and I have a couple more boxes on the way. Even though I just got into Funkos, I ordered uh, a good bit of them. Like I'm diving in pretty deep in this stuff because. because oh no no no! That was that was probably oh, okay. I don't know how to edit. Okay, go ahead and press stop. <laughs> okay, just record. Okay, this is unboxing these from Walmart. Six mysteries. I don't think there was any guaranteed grails or anything like that. I don't. I'm, I honestly have no idea because when I wore these, I didn't know anything about Funkos, and I've kind of been learning as I go. Uh, okay, I don't. I don't see any. Um, Hard packs. Okay, what is this one? Pe oh, from uh, Married with Children. Peggy Bundy. <laughs> my, I used to watch that show, actually. That's pretty cool. Man, see, the cool thing about these is, is you always know someone that watches something, so if you ever need a gift idea... Okay, Miss Mr. Bean Pajamas. I never watched Mr. Bean. I'm not gonna lie. He seemed goofy. He seemed like fun, but... I just never got into it. But that's cool though. That's cool. A lot of Mr. Bean fans out there. And we got Richard from The Walking Dead. I think this was after I stopped watching. I, I got I stopped watching right around the time because I moved. Uh where they started revealing um the king and his tiger and all that and um n n oh yeah, no, I went past that. I saw a little bit of the Negan action, the Negan um season. It was cool. Um I, just, I honestly can't remember who this is, so 
but that's still cool. I'll take any Walking Dead that I can come across. Same with Resident Evil, anything like that. Um, Zivania, the Umbrella Academy. Okay, and this, I have no idea. I don't, I don't know. There's gonna be a lot of this new age stuff that I just don't, I don't follow super closely or anything. But anything anime, I'm going to love. I love anime. I love. Okay, what is Selena Mayer? Um, I don't know what the value is on any of these. Um, so far, it's on. Oh, Vanna White. Oh my. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. Mama, see, my mom would would love this. Like. I a, you always know someone, but I got a lot of, um, okay, I don't quite know what a bunch of this stuff is, but, okay, that's not bad, this was like a, um, okay, how much was this box? This, this box was only like, um, uh, 46 bucks after shipping, like 7 bucks for shipping, but it came with, um, and this is Toy Wiz. Right, and it came from with Walking Dead Richard, Mr. Bean Pajamas, Will of Fortune, Vanna White, Veep. I, I, is that a show? I guess it's a show. Selena, Selena Meyer, The Umbrella Academy, Vanya, and Married with Children. And these were ones I knew what they were. But I plan on um, getting a whole bunch of these armors because I like... I like these things, how protected they seem to be in these. Like, I wish those would have came in them because I could, I noticed a couple of little, was like, smudges and uh, dots on a couple of them. But they look, they look pretty good for the most part. I mean, it's kind of what I'm, what I'm aiming for. It's just really new, really good looking ones that I can see it because I plan on preserving them. You know, I, I, I want to be able to look in 10 years and they look exactly like this. But anyway, this is my first unboxing. I'm a... Uh, I'm gonna look up the value on all these because I always enjoyed people saying, "Oh yeah, this is oh that's a surprise guest, uh, Madam Whiskers. She has really long whiskers, super long." But I always enjoy uh, people looking at the prices and saying what they were. So I'm gonna I'm gonna look all these up and give you an up to date PPC no up to date uh, price on all of them, and then uh, and come back. Okay, so looked up all the prices for everything and. Um, Richard over here, eight bucks, uh, not much, nothing fancy. Mr. Bean, uh, pajamas, nine bucks. Van and White, eight bucks. Um, Selena Mayer, twelve bucks. Wait, yeah, that one, twelve bucks. Vanya, ten bucks, and Peggy Bundy, six bucks. And all these, these I can I can't find a price on because no one's selling them and they don't really have an established currency for them, but. Uh, one thing I know is I'm not taking any of these out of the boxes ever. Like so, whatever whatever their current value is, that's you know I I, I can say I, I, you know I'm just trying to justify it by not taking an L or anything. You know I'm just going to view this as something I'm just going to hold on to and you know and hope it maintains and grows in value because it's valuable to me. Some of these that I like, it's hard to value something when you don't even know what it's from. You know I'm not going to go research shows to look up and find out what they're about just because i got a funko pop form for them someone else might already be a fan of it you know but you know i could see myself keeping keeping i might keep mr bean peggy's cool because she's from my bed. now these three okay man i might keep man too but <laughs> i might get rid of these two and and, then, and keep these other ones i don't i don't really have a, a strict game plan going forward with this it's just i i enjoy hearing people's perspective on these things and seeing them unbox and um you know just finding out about them. i don't like i don't like how the, you'll find some scuffs and stuff so this isn't meant like i don't i'm not happy about that like i only want everything in my collection to just be looking brand new that way you know the the person that does value it you know even if i don't value it, i still want whoever does value it to get a to get be happy about receiving it and whatnot but yeah, this was a Walmart Walmart mystery box. I'm probably not going to do it again. Um, because, I I mean, half the characters, I don't know who they are. And none of them were, were like, a big enough come up to to really make me want to roll the dice on that again. You know, in the, in the condition of it, you know, that, that came across. I don't know if that's on Walmart or or what. But I, I don't think any of these are going to be in mint. They all got little scuffs, except for these, because um, they're in the pot protectors. That's why I really like these. I plan on getting a lot more protectors because it's whatever. But anyway, this is uh yeah, this is my first video. I'm a real big Rick and Morty fan. Love that stuff. 
I'm uh, planning on, I have some more boxes coming here um, next Sunday, I think. So I should be making another video and uh, they're going to be way cooler videos than this one. Like these, this this is when I, fr I just got into it and I'm just now getting the first stuff that I kind of went through. And, oh, I want that, 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 mystery boxes and stuff. And these, this is the, this is going to be the lamest um, one that I have. All the other stuff I'm super excited about. They got two, $200 boxes um, coming from Walmart too, so... Um, Hopefully on Sunday, I believe it will be. So it'll be a lot cooler than these because I don't even, and, you know, and I looked at all the pops that could be in the ones coming up and they're, they're just way cool. I had no idea that this, this whole box, I, I was clueless. They have a Batman silhouette on it for no, some reason. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't get no Batman, <laughs> whatever, but yeah, it's first, uh, first unboxing. Hopefully more come. Uh, appreciate anyone that stuck around and watched. Uh, have a good one.